Hello and welcome back to Like a Dragon Gaiden. So, uh, I just got done uh, inhaling water on accident, so my throat is a little scratchy at the moment, but it's going to be fine. Uh, we we started the game in the last one and learned a bit, a, a bit of you know exposition dump intro stuff, uh, and also Hanawa, the guy we met, just got kidnapped. Sort of. I mean, we kind of just let him go. And he's being used as, like, a pawn blackmail to get uh, Kiryu to talk to the w Watase family. So anyway, uh, right now we're trying to... What, what was the objective? It'd be best to avoid being questioned by the police. I should get away from here. Yeah, we're currently just trying to get away. Uh, apparently you... Oh, yeah. We did just unlock Yakuza style. Quick step strike. How to hit Mr. Try and Hit Me. <laughs> Man. There have been so many Mr. Try and Hit Me's in this series. So many. I might as well have bought that though. Oh, wait, wait. Is there any items? No. Oh! Hell yeah. Oh, wow. At least they're, like, really bright blue. I really like that color of uh, bright blue. I wonder... Hold on here. Oh man. It's unfortunate. I wanted to make my mic that color, but the green screen... The green screen decided uh, that it wanted to diminish the blue color because it's very similar to the green screen. <clears throat> Damn. It looks it looks perfect uh, in front of me, though. Is that a cop? Oh. Hiding any... Th can I go up here? Oh, I can. Can I jump this? I don't think we get parkour like like Algamy though. Police, I'd like to avoid any run-ins, but I shouldn't wander just wander around aimlessly. Until Sudano calls, it's a waiting game. I should find somewhere to have a smoke. Should quit that. I say hypocritically as I smoked for 16 years, quit quit like four years ago, but best thing I've ever done. You know, this would be a good place to hide. <laughs> would you just let me? Okay. Okay. I guess we, we, could, we could do this. Uh, I do, I do want to like at least play each mini game on the series. I, I'm not going to show me like. Usually they have objectives like, I don't know, get 50, get 15 UFO catcher prizes, that kind of stuff. I'm not going to show all 50, but. Yeah. Oh, I don't expect to actually get that one. One thing I've learned from... From Judgment is uh, most of the time you can get away with doing this and that to just inch it over and then it falls in on its own. This one's kind of big for that though. Oh, it's like pressed against the window though. I think it's stuck. Oh! There we go. Boomy. Uh, they <laughs> do they have the Nian, the Koro Nian? Um, how could I get this? If I go like too far back, maybe I could flip it this way. No, no. Well, maybe. Oh, so close. 
I don't know if I care about getting the rest of these pigs right now. <clears throat> That's you. Oh, yeah. This is uh, Sonic the Fighters on Easy? Blast City? Were these ones in Judgment? I remember seeing an achievement for Sonic the Fighters, but I haven't. Uh... Sega Racing Classic 2. I, I haven't I haven't done all the arcade games in that yet. Oh god, Motor Raid. Uh, as much as I want to play all of them, we could be sitting here all day. <laughs> I'll come back when I know there's an objective for them. Oh, hey. Might as well just fight you guys. Ooh, I'm kind... I'm kind of, uh... Ooh. Kind of better at managing flinch while charging, it seems. It's just whoever... The, the boss I fought... Uh, it still knocked me out of it regardless. Anything up top? No. Guess this will work. Damn, fresh out. Guess I should head to a convenience store. Okay. If I make my way through here, I should get there. I'd be less likely to be noticed if I take this route. So it seems good. Wait, where are we near right now? Oh. I want to go here. <laughs> is there anywhere we can go in here? I think this is the place that has the... Suji... Suji decks. This is a gambling hall. Yeah. I know, like, the very basics of Mahjong, but I really don't know how to play Mahjong. Uh, I don't even know what, like, rules I actually know to go by. Someday. Someday I'll learn how to play. If you can't tell, I that, that means, yes, I have not 100%ed. <laughs> the only game I 100%ed is Like a Dragon. Yak Yakuza like a dragon, not like a dragon anything else. Ooh, there we go. Ichiba Well that's a reference. There's no way he's met Arena yet. Er uh A Airy? Uh, the damn cops are cops are sniffing around out front. I'll just wait them out. Probably won't be too long. Okay, monitor. They shouldn't stay for long. I'll stick around and monitor the situation. Excellent. Seems like they're gone. There's no telling what situation I might end up in. I should do some shopping here while I'm at it. I don't have that much money, though. Mountain Dew? Mountain Dew's back? Um, he wanted smokes, so I guess I'll buy... These usually fill your heat gauge. Right? I'll buy three packs. And... Yeah, we need toughness, see. I'll get five. How much does this heal for? I wish you could see how much they healed for. Uh, it does not heal in Lost Judgment that much. It's like the smallest part of a bar. Um, let's get, let's get, let's get these. Yeah, I'll buy ten of them. There's, Why not? Joryu. Yeah, I'll buy ten of we lost Hanawa's GPS signal here. We need to hear what happened. Get back to the temple now. Who are you? Hold on. 
The people responsible for last night's attack abducted Hanawa. I'm waiting for a phone call from them. Hey! Like I said, you can tell us everything back at the temple. Give it back. First, return to the temple, then report to us. I'm in charge of you while Hanuwa's gone. In other words, I'm your superior. Know your damn place. <clears throat> yes, sir? That guy seems like a bad guy. So they call themselves Omi Alliance. But there was no definitive proof of that, was there? Which means you can't say for certain if they're really with the Omi. Yeah, mm. that's why I need that phone back. If they call and I don't answer it, Hanawa will be in danger. You don't need to worry about that. The phone signal has been cut off. Wouldn't want a GPS giving our location away. Uh, what? I'm saying that even if they do call, it won't go through. Then, why did you bring me here? Who said you could ask questions? Your report's not over. Let's hear the rest of it. Enough of this! I don't know what's going on! You're not supposed to. Just who do you think you are? We can't afford to be wasting time like this. One of your own was taken hostage. They're gonna kill Hano if I don't stay in contact. And if they do, it'll mean he's done talking. What? Hanawa's capture means we have to resign ourselves to a breach of confidentiality. After all, if they resort to torture, no way could he keep his lips sealed. This is your fault, Joryu. What? But even if things do get out, we'll just have to retreat underground again. You're just gonna abandon Hanawa? Before you've even tried to save him? If he were truly loyal to the Daidoji, he would have already killed himself. And if he hasn't, He's now worth the risk we need to take to save him. Is that how the Daidoji do things? Or do you just not want the blame to fall on you for all this? Hmm. Don't speak like you know anything. Get him. <clears throat> we should have done this from the beginning. They say you were a legendary Yakuza. Hmm. <laughs> but in the end, how are you any different from us? We both operate in the shadows, do we not? You will get no more special treatment. When there's an assignment for you, it will not be pleasant. And if you refuse, both you and those children in Okinawa will be punished. There's always a guy like you, huh? Disgusting use of power. <laughs> My name is Yoshimura. I'm looking forward to our time together. Make him understand his position. Take as much time as you like. Give me back that phone. They're gonna call. We can still save Hanawa! <sighs> Aren't they supposed to keep Kiryu silent? Aren't you risking his silence by getting on his bad side? Like, why are they blackmailing him? That seems a little ridiculous. We don't like this any more than you do, cheer you, son. But, well, since we're going to be working together from here on out, how about we introduce ourselves with our fists? They captured one of your own. And yet you're still doing whatever that bastard tells you? Someday, you'll be the one left for dead. Well, you might be right, but at least we'll last longer than you. Pardon the interruption. <laughs> what is it? There is something I must show you. This here is the phone Kiryu-san was carrying. It's not supposed to be on, is it? Ooh. Uh, something about the enemy discovering our location? If you know that, then why not turn it off? Why? Because I wish to save Hanawa-san, of course. Hey, what are you doing? You said we should introduce ourselves with our fists, right? Can I grab that table? So how about we get better acquainted? Shh. 
adore you, you cocky little. Let's go. Okay, he's got some decent lines. I, I still don't feel like Kiryu, but it's starting to get a little. I'm get I'm getting used to it. I wouldn't say he's a he's doing a bad job at all though. He's certainly giving it his all. Oh, uh, no, 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 just let me, uh, <laughs> all right, you, that didn't work. I wanted to pull him. There we go. Nope, oh, that, that, there we go. All right, I think I'm gonna do this. Ooh. Damn, that runs out way too fast. Yeah, let's go. Wait, what? Did it really not work? The only thing I'm noticing is they screwed up the audio balancing a little bit. Like some of his lines are recorded in from pinch, back here. You still resort to violence to resolve things. We still have a ways to go in our training, don't we? <laughs> is this really what you wanted? It might not end well for you. Please do not worry. I'm not even a real monk. <laughs> this temple and I are simply a facade. Just part of the front for the Daidoji faction. Yeah. I thought that might be the case. Please save Hanawa-san. To tell you the truth, I was the one who recruited him. Once upon a time, I was one of the Daidoji's treasurers. Oh. I needed someone capable to work under me. So I pulled him into this criminal underworld. He was slightly lacking in personality, but when it really mattered, you could always count on him. I agree. And because of that, I won't let him die in their hands. We still have a chance to save him now that I have this phone back. You must get out of here first. More men will be coming. Please, leave this place. If you do not make it out of here, you will not save him. Yeah, I know. He kind of looks like Komaki. I can't remember how Komaki looks now. And he clearly ta taught us the agent art. Wow. <laughs> Hold on. Let me just knock you down. Uh... I want to I want to taunt but they're not down long enough. Never mind, it doesn't matter. Ooh. I, ooh, three items. Conquering emperor? Good amount of health, okay. <laughs> Oh, look how much the... Oh, my God. The egg sandwich actually heals for a decent amount. Oops. P pick up. Uh, I do kind of want that attack, though. Yeah. I think it's worth it. We lose quite a bit of... Defense, though. Square. Oh, my. <laughs> oh. Yeah, let's go. Don't worry, he's never killed anyone. Never. Uh, that was a rubber knife. Here we go. 
Oh. Damn. Uh, I need to... Wait, didn't I unlock a dodge... Dodge move? I think that's it. I think I scared him. I'm almost at full heat. I'm just kind of... Okay, I think I'm bleeding. Should probably use that in an egg sandwich. What the... God damn. Going somewhere, Mr. Legendary Yakuza? Umbrella gun? Oh boy. I think I just canceled it. Oh, oh, oh. oh well, there goes my heat. Okay. Ooh. They're kind of forgiving with that uh, ultimate attack dodge. That was a perfect time to dodge. Oh. oh, I got it. Damn. Uh, let's see again. Wow, that heals for a lot. Oh, I forgot. It was called Ichiban before Ichiban helped out. So... It doesn't mean that he met with Eri yet. <laughs> Ichiban Senbei. Is there really nothing out here? Oh, wait. Nope. Oh, there is stuff up here, though. I'm probably going to regret being on this difficulty. The one thing that's hard with Yakuza games is when you're fighting someone, if they like move to the side or something, I, I can't tell if I'm supposed to just keep my stance and fight in that direction, or should I lean towards them? Like it's, taking a stance isn't exactly locking on, but it kind of is at the same time. It's really weird. Ooh. Don't think so, dickhead. You ain't getting away from us. <laughs> oh, oh! I was that an ultimate attack? Holy shit! Yeah, see, I'm like, I continue attacking in a weird direction. Um, back up, back up. Damn. Yeah, I can't do that, that's for sure. How about this? <laughs> it's, so, it's so awkward. So awkward. Okay, they all seem to have kind of a similar one going on there. Oh. Man, he had some cool moves though. There he is. Don't let Zoro you get away. Oh my god. That would hurt. 
Uh, I do want to check this because I remember complaining that it wasn't working last time. Uh, break into a sprint and press triangle. Your health must be low. Okay, that's why it wasn't working. Near a group of three enemies. Uh, okay. Wow, there's more? Alright, let me look through these quick. Okay, so most of these are uh, for being in Yakuza style and using something nearby, like uh, a pole or a rail or something. Um, fast footwork, though. Extreme heat mode required if you quick step and press triangle. You get a you get one. That, that one seems interesting. Triangle after landing a front kick in extreme heat mode. Stuns, grab an enemy near another enemy, and this one you have to be at full health? That'll never happen. Ah, <laughs> uh, taxis and... Okay. Don't think these are important things to track right now. Pros and cons of getting drunk. Heat gauge charges faster. Huh. I... Okay. Okay. I came from here. I need to go that way, but... Hey man, there's nothing. No QTs? Oh, I see that crush you just now. <laughs> what the? What? what? Caltrops? Interesting. I'm guessing I'm going to get these things at some point, right? Oh man, that That is very forgiving, honestly. <laughs> You're gone. There's absolutely a boss right through here. Why don't you just give up? Mm. <clears throat> what do you got? Oh, uh, what? Okay, he tends to, uh... I think that was his ultimate. I think I could have dodged that. Yeah, he tends to keep attacking in that direction app. What the... That was brutal. Alright, sir. Nah, I should be in, uh, Yakuza. There we go. Okay, that did not drop my gauge. Oh, okay. Kind of trapped in a corner here. I wonder if it's better to charge or not. Uh, it's kind of a waste of time at the moment. Kind of a waste of time during X gauge or extreme mode to charge, unless it does more damage. All I know is it usually breaks guards like that. <laughs> uh, damn. Hold. Sneaky. Oh, another one. 
Yeah. Um. <clears throat> That's a lot of guys. Ready for this. Now you've really done it. You've made an enemy of the entire Daidoji just to save one man. Out of my way. I just... lost my patience with incompetent leadership. Why go to such lengths to save Hanoa? In the end, he's just another pair of eyes on you. What is it to you if he's tortured or killed somewhere? I've... given up my past. My life. And even my name. I have no hope for the future. He's the only connection I've made during this dull, pathetic existence. Hmm. Hmm. To think that the dragon of Dojima would sound so pitiful. <laughs> Even when a Yakuza put a gun to his head, Hanawa told me not to bother saving him. Wanted me to prioritize myself and the people I care about over his own life. If I turn my back on him and become your lapdog, what would I have left? What a load of bull. Why the hell should I care? Yeah, didn't think you'd understand. And to be honest, I don't care. But if you're gonna stand in my way, I'm gonna have to make you step aside. Fine by me. Uh-oh. Bring it on! Yeah. Uh, Let's go. grab him. <laughs> oh, what? Oh, right, disarm. I forgot you could do that. Wait, so if I, like... Oh, what? Oh, that didn't disarm. <laughs> oh, yeah, that's not, that's not gonna be great. Maybe I should, uh... He's about to shoot. Oh. Oh god, this sucks. Throw him! There. Wait, can I just... Okay, yeah. Double O. Oh my god, why, why with the gun? Oh, wow. Okay, there are QTs. Yeah, time to heal. So I'm trying to control my mic volume here, because I know I can get quite loud sometimes. Oh, my. What? Wow, you are. I'll fill your corpse with bullet holes. Oh, I thought he was doing an ultimate. There it is. Alright, hold on, hold on, sir. Um throw <laughs> Oh come on. How many bullets do you have? Don't you have to reload? I'm about to die. I should have just ran at him and killed him. Worth it. I, sw I swear I'll get better. This is the phone, Saruno, Saruno, Saruno? Yeah, gave me. Did your phone die? Yeah, it's on now. Thought maybe you turned your back on Hanosa. I take it he's alive? Yep, ain't gonna go and kill a valuable hostage. Make sure to come to the place I'm about to tell you. It's called Survive. It's adjoined mm. in Ichincho's bar district. 
I'll be waiting there for you. And make sure to come alone. Of course. But it'll be some time before I arrive. Don't worry about it. We can track your location with the GPS after all. And no turning that phone off without warning again, alright? Be seeing ya. It's kind of sad that like when I first did my let's play of Yakuza Like a Dragon, I didn't know the story very well, like the whole overall storyline. I didn't even know who uh, the owner of Survive was. Not that they outright say it, but it's Welcome. pretty obvious. I'm meeting someone. Go right ahead. Hey, lady. Get my friend here one of what I'm having. Of course. Why this place? Because it's the safest spot in all of Ijincho. Usually, the scary-ass bartender's keeping a close eye on things. But sounds like he's got a bad back today. Yeah. Yes, he's out sick. Sorry about that. How convenient. It's fine. I wonder if Kitty would be surprised. Didn't expect you to be so true to your word. You're alone? Thought you'd bring a few of your men with you. I just want to talk. Need you to open up your heart to me a bit. How's Hanawa? Still breathing. He's part of the reason I want to chat. You said you're operating under orders from Watase. Isn't he in jail? I saw it on the news at some point. We got our orders right before he went in. Yep, it's taken us that long to follow your trail. But finally, here I am, sitting right across from you. Sorry to break it to you. But I'm not this Kazuma Kiryu you guys are looking for. Jeez, knock it off already. From watching you, we figure we've got the gist of what's going on. You made some kind of deal with the Daidoji faction, didn't you? I'm guessing their end involves protecting Haruka Sawamura and the kiddos at Morning Glory. Anyway, here's my theory. Daidoji was the fixer. And he had a secret society with a nasty reputation. The Yomei Alliance that supposedly killed you in Hiroshima. Our muscle for him. You beat their pants off. But in order to make a deal with the Daidoji, you had no choice but to die. Which means you agreed to all this. That being the case, I'm thinking maybe you were the one who came up with the whole idea. All to protect those precious little tots. Speaking the models. of kids, say we take him hostage too. Would you talk to us then? Go ahead. Try it. You, your crew, Watase. I'll make you regret you were ever born. Well, seems like my theory was on the money. It's Suruno, right? Supposing I am Kazuma Kiryu. What does Watase want with me? Before I can tell you that, I'll need you to promise me you'll do it. Else, my lips are sealed. No guarantee on Hanawa-san's life either. You want me to agree to something before knowing what it is? There's something in it for you too, of course. If you accept our deal, I'll get rid of that Daidoji collar around your neck. What? It's simple. All you gotta do is die. One more time. What? If you do what the boss is asking, we'll fake Kazuma Kiryu's death once again. But this time, it won't be the world you're deceiving. It'll be the Daidoji. Okay. If they think you're dead dead, ain't no point watching you any longer, yeah? Haruka Sawamura and the other kids. It'd be a big ask to live with them again, but... Might just be able to meet up once in a while. You'd get to see him again. All them kids at morning glory. But for That's that to happen, Hanawa-san has to die. What? If we're gonna convince folks that Kazuma Kiryu died a second time, we'll need Hanawa-san's body. Hmm. Is that really so bad? 
He's the very man holding your leash for the Daidoji. Just break away and be free. What's there to worry about? You're about to die and come back to life again, Kyu-san. Yeah, I mean, he, he, he would never accept it. Never. Castle on the water. I love the way they're updating this, uh, these transitions. Oh! That's a PNG out there. Don't look too close. <laughs> You guys ready to leave yet? We've still got to buy flowers. Oh, this is going to be really weird. Hi, I know. Where's my clothes? I told you, I don't know. Come on, you're not Haruto. All right, now. Time to go, Haruto. Holy... You're about to die and come back to life again, Kyu-san. How many years has it been? If you agree to come with us, the reward will be considerable. You can put that guarantee on the Watase family name. But for that to happen, you're saying Hanawa needs to die. Yup. So here's my plan. First, I'll dredge up a corpse with a build like yours. When the Daidoji find it next to Hanawa-san, they'll think it's you. Publicly, both bodies will be declared unidentified. Corpse of the build like mine. You find those lying around often? Don't underestimate the Omi. Shit like that's a piece of cake. We even got a corner in the loop. This time it'll be us outwitting the Daidoji. I see. Sounds like a solid plan. Now we're speaking the same language. Sure. We would be if I were actually Kazuma Kiryu. Uh, are you still going on about that? Let Hanawa go. That's the only reason I came here. Uh, Kiryu-san! I told you, you've got the wrong guy. <sighs> well, sitting here staring at each other is getting us nowhere. What's that supposed to be? Just what it looks like. A red tiger. Yeah, and I'm asking you what it means. There's someone in charge of the homeless in Osaka Sotenbori. Name's Akame. I want you to find them and show them this. Hanawa-san is being taken there as we speak. It'll serve as a clue to help in your pursuit. Why are you doing this? Because the boss is the only one vouching for you. Rest of us aren't so convinced. Why should I go to all the trouble of bringing you into the fold? We're getting damn tired of waiting for you to prove yourself. You should have realized from the start. I told you, I'm not... Ah, you say you're not Kazuma Kiryu one more time. And Hanawa gets it. I'll leave you to make your own way to Sotenbori. Bring anyone else, the negotiations are over. You can bet you'll never see us again. As for Hanawa-san, good luck finding his corpse. So show the tiger to this Akame guy, and then what? Go and see for yourself. Akame's territory is on the south side of the Sotenbori River. Ask around there, and someone's bound to know. That's all I feel like telling you. What? Is this a game to you? Yup, but that don't mean you can dilly-dally. If the Dragon of Dojima is really everything they say he is, then he'll find answers soon enough. And if he ain't, then I guess this is all a waste of time. It's up to you if you want to leave Hanawa-san hanging. Literally. Do what you want. 
Okay. Why are they trying so hard? Hello? Hello. That's me. Joryu. I've been waiting to hear from you. Any update on Hanuma-san? He's still a hostage. Somewhere in Sotembori, on Omi turf. I'm headed there now. Very well. What can I do from here? If you don't hear from me in the next three days, pass that info to the Daidoji. It'll mean I failed to save Hanoa. His life will be in your hands. Will it? I can't imagine the Daidoji will rush in to save you two. I know. I just figured someone should tell them. Because if I die, then Hanawa's whereabouts die with me. Very well. I appreciate your consideration. So... You know, I actually haven't noticed... I I've been kind of getting used to Kiryu's voice by... By paying attention to these other voices and some of their deliveries. I'm a little scared to hear Haruka more than, like, the few lines we've got. She sounded very different. Sotenbori. Do we get to hang out with cats in this game, too? You're really following that cat. When was... Last time here was with Haruka. Or technically Akiyama. I don't know which one. Uh, you play both of them here, but I think that was the last time that you were... Saw Sotenbori. Well, besides in Yakuza Like a Dragon, but that hasn't happened yet in this timeline. First, I've got to find uh, Akame. Suruno was saying their territory is on the south side of the Sotenbari River. How much? Okay, we got full rain. Full rain of this area. I. It's been a while since I played, like, Zero, I remember spending the most time here. And I kind of played Zero... I didn't... I played one, two, six. Uh, and then zero. <laughs> I went I went back, which was a little weird, but I, I did that. And then I replayed seven before doing this while watching the Let's Plays after I finished one and two. So... Uh, I played zero kind of recently, but I still don't remember too much about, like, the layout. I spent quite a bit of time with Majima's side of things, though. Uh, didn't didn't completely 100% it. There's a lot of games to go through. Alright, let's take a look around at the very least. Oh, I see something. I bet there's... yeah. I'm probably going to need to grab a ton of healing. Also, in 7, I believe, is it right over there there's an arena? Uh, this would be around the time of 7, so maybe there's an arena there in this game too? I don't see why there wouldn't be. Oh, God damn it! Can I jump? I don't know who you're looking for, but most people are running from their past. Ooh, wait, is that a gift? Oh, no. It's not gear, right? Yeah. Other. Great gift for a special lady. Uh-oh. Do you really, do you really have time to do that in this game? I don't know how much time I'll actually show that stuff, because a lot of it is, uh... 
We'll, we'll see. We'll see. Uh, do I need to eat? Nope. Oh, I will after this. Wait, wait, wait. Wait. There we go. Holy sh... I'm pretty sure I missed that. Oh, it's so weird not having, like, heat segments. Have a little rest. I mean, the most recent time I've played has been 180 hours of Judgment games, so, like, having the X segments, I'm so used to that. Uh, I wanted to... Yeah, we'll get that. Apparently, tuna and egg sandwich? Decent heels, so. Alright, there'll be plenty of time to look around later. I think I'll just head towards the goal. Oh, hello. Also, I just made 100k, so. Kinda worth it. 200k? Hi. Hey. Do you know Akame? Akame-san? Yeah. Now that you mention it. I saw Akame-san heading into the parking lot. You might catch up if you hurry. How do I recognize him? Who is he? You'll know when you get there, man. Better hurry, though. Well, that's suspicious. Oh. I guess if I would have went over there, it wouldn't have done anything. Huh. Okay. Uh, <laughs> let's head that way, then. That guy kind of looked like, uh... Oh. Uh... Is he also called Tsukumo? Oh, this is embarrassing. I'm, I'm playing the game, but I always forget people's names. Tsukumo. He had the same hair, the same, like... Everything but a mustache. Oh, yeah. Hi, guys! Oh, oh. Hold on, I want to try to uh, see if I can do this. Right, first, I have to move people. How do I... Oh! No way. It doesn't, it doesn't work. Okay, so I can pull people to me, though. Jesus. Also, what does this do? No, no special spider action when you have heat mode up. Dang it. Uh, after I decide to take a break, I'll come back and uh, I'll, I'll look through, like, the help list and try to get used to the controls a bit. Huh. What gives you, old goat? I'm looking for someone named Akame. Know anything? What business you got with Akame-san? Beats me. Huh. What kind of dumb shit answer is that? I'm not trying to be rude. I was told to find Akame and show them this. Oh, hold it, old man. That's... It's what? <laughs> no way. You really don't know? Not a clue. <laughs> <laughs> now that's priceless. So, can you help me out? I'm searching for a friend that's been kidnapped. This thing's my only clue. Not much good if you don't even know what you got. <laughs> Maybe my crew and I should take her off your hands. How about it? Oh, seems I picked the wrong person to ask. <laughs> you look pretty calm, old geezer. Sure you're not scared shitless. Hard to tell with you wearing those shades. Enough. 
I don't want to be forced to hurt you. Yeah, yeah, you demented coot. Hand it over while I'm still asking nicely. I warned you. That's my line, limp dick! What are you talking? Th these guys look older than Kiryu. He's not that old. What? I know he probably should be old, but he, he's not that old. <laughs> Visually, at least. Oh. Alright, uh, oh, oh, he's getting ready. You know, I feel like some of these people are in English and some aren't. Some of the attack and or attack sounds are like possibly Japanese. You're testing my patience. Take me to Akame. I'm done wasting my time. All right, quit the dick measuring. <laughs> Haven't seen you before. You got guts coming to Sotenbori. And all by your lonesome, too. Must be tough shit. Who are you? <laughs> Aren't you the one who's looking for me? So, you're Akame? Last I checked. Would you mind not gawking at me? Oh, God. Sotenbori's jack of all trades. You... Kinda seem familiar. I was familiar. in charge of the homeless around here. Gotta say, you're not what I expected. Hey now, that's not the only thing I do. Call me a jack of all trades. Fixer or informant, you name it. It all depends on the client. Hey, you ever gonna let that poor guy go? <laughs> so? What do you want from me? Well, well. A red tiger. So, you're a guest of the Watase family? Yeah. A man named Suno told me to show this to you. Ah. I get it now. Okay, how about you come with me, then? Wait, I, I never said I was on board. Do you work for Suno? As a lackey or something? <laughs> no way. Not me. Suruno san and I've never met in person. Our relationship is strictly business. Huh? Then what about Hanawa? Hanawa? Who the hell's that? Are you serious? So this Akame chick doesn't even know where Hana Hanawa is? Then why the hell did he send me here to meet her? I, I, I don't know what you expected, buddy, but just leave it to me. Come on. I try not to make a habit of following suspicious people. Uh, I'm not Yakuza though, you know? That still doesn't mean I can trust you. Hmm. Well, you might have a point there. By the way... Hmm? What should I call you? So, Suruno really didn't tell you a thing? Nah, nothing. All I know is whoever turns up with a red tiger is in for some hospitality. So... That means you're clueless, too? Yeah. What do you mean by hospitality? Hmm, I think it'll be more fun as a surprise. That tiger is an access pass to a very unique venue. Oh? Actually, we can't head there just yet, so cool your jets. <sighs> it's Joryu. Hmm? You can call me Joryu. Well, as you already know, I'm Akame. Anyway, let's move, Joryu. Okay. Uh, sure. I like how red her hair is. It is very red. Looks a little less red outside this of cutscene. Is... My office. Typically off limits, but you're our special guest, so enjoy this red tiger welcome. This is an office? Bit of a dump, right? This used to be a warehouse for a cabaret club called Odyssey. Mm. Now, well, it serves its purpose. A retinal scanner? <laughs> I'll get you registered on that thing in a bit. 
Registered? What what are we signing up for? What do you think? Welcome to my lovely office. Feel free to use it as you like till we head to the venue I mentioned. Oh. The exterior is somewhat misleading. Well, if I glitz things up, I just become a target. I deal with plenty of creeps on the job. Always pays to be careful. You said you were a jack of all trades. Is one of those trades organized crime? That's real funny coming from the guy with the red tiger. Uh, mm. Make yourself at home. Just let me register your eyes in the scanner. That way you can come and go as you please. We got a hideout? Alrighty. That should do it. You're all set. Hey, you got pretty eyes. So what's with the glasses? Aren't you just a guide? Stick to your job and stop the questions. Whoa. Why all the hostility? Well, you're free to leave if you'd like. Or we could keep talking. I'll be hanging out here for a while, okay? That was a weird choice of dialogue for Kiryu. Uh... Have they started writing him a little differently? Because uh, that's totally not just a voice actor thing. He seems like he's a little more rough to people. In a, in a very strange way. Like, normally he would be reluctant, but totally answer her. But instead, saying stop with the stupid questions. That could be an English translation thing, though. Uh, that's a little off, but... I don't think I've ever heard him talk that way to anyone who hasn't punched him. <laughs> you know? This is a nice looking place, though. I would totally live here. Uh, the outside of the building, it's a good idea, too. It looks very shitty. Uh, no one would <laughs> bother you here. So what's next, Joryu? Uh, tell me about yourself. Why don't you tell me about yourself? I told ya. I'm a jack of all trades. Guess I do a little bit of everything, legal or not. But buying and selling info is the most lucrative. I look after the homeless around here. In exchange, I get juicy intel. So that's what Suruno was referring to. I probably come off as some sort of community activist to outsiders, huh? But Osaka's got more homeless than anywhere else in Japan. Gotta use local conditions to my advantage if I want to stay afloat as a small business. Hmm. I like her... energy, I guess. Can we just move on to the venue already? Now's not a good time. We'll go tomorrow. Mm. Once we go, that's it. If you're not in tip-top shape, you'll regret it later. I can't afford to laze around. It's urgent. I have no idea what role Akame it has in all this. I should avoid discussing specifics. Plus, it seems like Suruno didn't tell her much. Or anything? He, he doesn't even seem to know that it's a girl? A slip-up might get her dragged into trouble. Hey, at least you got something to look forward to tomorrow. Just take it easy for today. What'll you do? Night's still young for me. I got a mountain of work. I'm not gonna strangle you in your sleep, so relax. Use that sofa if you need a nap, okay? So that'll advance the story. I might go out and look around a bit, uh, if it lets me. Um, what's going on up here? Oh, I can't, I can't like zoom in. Wait, phone camera. Yeah, I can't read any of that. that that's just all pixels. Music talk. Not much going on in here. She's kind of like a mini florist here. <laughs> um, hold on. Let me see. Can I leave? I can. I can. Uh, I'm probably going to end in a few, but... Yeah, you wouldn't introduce... Side, side stories have to be introduced in, like actual main mission, I believe. I don't think they've ever just like randomly given you side stories without What do we have here? Ooh. Sorry, bringing it up first. 
Man, it's been a while since I've seen the locker keys. Where where are the lockers? I would assume around the park. Come on. Now I gotta see if I can spot the rest of them. Oh, hey. Seaweed. Am I right? I don't seem to be right. This is the homeless park. Wait. Okay. Shiny flower ring. Uh, may maybe they're on the map. Maybe if I just, like, legend? There's no obvious name here. Lockers. No. I want to find these lockers. It's okay. I don't think anything like is going to surprise pop up. So I'm going <laughs> to I'm going to skip around while I look around the city quick. Oh hell yeah! I just found another key. Um, these lockers have got to be along Main Street somewhere. Uh, if I was going to guess. It'd be like here, maybe. Oh, Club Sega. Wait, do they have a uh, uh, Sotenbori of the Dead? I don't, I don't know what you'd call it in this. All I know is whatever Hama of the Dead was really fun. No. Not here. I'm guessing uh, Infinite Wealth is gonna have another one of those games, though. Oh, hello. Oh, I'm full. Where are the lockers? Oh my god, I just learned how to do this. Waste of time. So when you hold an enemy and you press O again, it pulls him to you and you just punch him. That That's... That that's how the the web thing works. I, I was a little off on my uh, guesses there. I still haven't found these lockers though. Uh, maybe they're along the river route. Oh oh, I have been on that side already. Let's check over here. I'm just doing like a. What do we have here? Depending on oh another key. Depending on how long we're in Sotenbori, I don't know how many locations there are, but I like to, you know, kind of look around the city. There you are! Getting ready for Ichiban to start his, uh, Coliseum arena run. Speaking of that, it kind of sounds like we're going to a Coliseum. Uh, she said venue and make sure you're in top shape, so... <laughs> Come on, I want to test this now. All right. Oh, didn't work. Oh. Yeah. So you just hit O and then. I'm too close. Ten thousand dollars for hitting them, though. I do need to go to Ebisu Pond and sell the thingies, which is... Uh-oh. I swear I saw it. Oh. I don't know how I missed that. Uh, we'll run over there quick. And then I will... <laughs> I will find the lockers and then we'll end. I'm about to be rich and can actually buy upgrades. Oh, hello. Where are these? No, oh, that's Smile Breaker. Welcome in. Uh, nope. Thank you for so. Welcome in. I have two of these, and 
four of those? I think they're only for selling, right? I, I hope that's the case, because I Thank just you for visiting. did that. Welcome in. Oh, uh, is there anything good here? 250 attack. For, for 2k? That's pretty cheap. Oh, standard darts. Yeah, sure. Why not? Oh, no. <laughs> Is pocket circuit back? Are we getting old man fighter? Obviously, it's back. An outer frame for pocket circuit cars, huh? Okay, okay. Uh, oh, we even get the uh, arcade system in our hideout? Judgment? Lost Judgment has that. I, uh, judgment does not. How come I can buy multiple of these? Huh. Golden ball. If you collect seven, you'll be granted a wish? Weird. Michi, Michio. Pocket circuit decal? Why not? Thank you for visiting. Okay. Oh boy. If there's pocket circuit. Uh I'm gonna be I'm gonna be a bit screwed here. Alright, I'm gonna see if I can find this. Find these lockers. There they are. Okay. I'm being chased right now though. Sure you want Alright. No no. Yeah, I gra grab Okay. Sir? Bring me that bat. Wait, can I do anything in the restaurant? Uh. <laughs> Probably not, because there's no way I'm getting him over here. Maybe? It wasn't happening. Waste of time. Sir, I need some health. Wild Jackson. Dozens of restaurants and bars off the city. Eating or drinking restores health. Depending on what you order, you can't eat when you're full. Hmm. Oh, and that's about getting drunk. Yeah. Uh, the nope. The best bet is to find something small. Oh, there's no way to get, like, four things. There we go. Now we can get four things. This is good. I'm out. Is there a checklist? We don't seem to have the... <laughs> the, the checklist thing for... For like get eating all the meals and all that stuff, so that's probably for the best. I get consumed by those. Hey. I see. Okay. All right, it worked. Okay, Terrainer Maximum. I see. Another uh, Master System game. Awesome. Oh oh. A key. I mean, it was right here. All right, it worked. I already have body armor. I can only have one slot right now, right? <laughs> I'll take the attack. All right, well, I'm going to head back there. I don't know. We'll just head back there in the next one. Uh, I'm going to end it here. In the next one, depending on if they uh, tutorial quest me, and depending on how many there would be, uh, we might be doing side quests in the next one. Uh, we'll, we'll, we'll see. But that's it for this one. Thanks for watching. Let me know if you like it, and I will see you in the next one.